gentlemen, 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 before we get into this video, which will be epic, I promise, I just want you to know that I think you are amazing, each and every one of you. Um, something that just kind of has I've been thinking about a little bit, um, and I just wanted to let you know that if you're having a bad day, you're having a bad week, a month, a year, don't lose hope. Right? I know that it can be a little bit overwhelming. I know that sometimes you can't see exactly like the light at the end of the tunnel, but I promise it's there. Just don't give up. Don't give in to self-doubt and wallow in self-pity. Just stay focused and move yourself forward in a positive direction. That is all. Now that that's out of the way and I feel better, let's talk about making your hair better. And the inspiration for this video is actually this morning. I woke up, I styled my hair, and I was like, yo, I'm having a pretty solid hair day. And for me, I don't know about you, whenever I have a good hair day, it seems like the rest of my day is pretty awesome. And so in an attempt to help you have more awesome hair days, I'm going over six simple things that we all can do to have better hair. First simple thing any guy can do to have better hair is condition your hair at least once a week. One of the things that, that I hear a lot of guys talk about is like, I don't need conditioner, I've got short hair. I don't need conditioner, I'm not a chick. Wrong! You need conditioner, your hair needs conditioner, whether or not it's super short or super luscious and long. The reason is because conditioner is helping replace and close the hair shaft, making it silky smooth. All of the product that we use, the heat, the hotness, the environment wreaks havoc on our luscious locks. And the way to combat that and make sure that your hair is looking as amazing as possible is condition once a week. The second simple thing any guy can do to have a better looking hairstyle is use a better hair dryer. Now this is obviously only appropriate for you guys out there who actually do blow dry their hair to give it a little extra volume, a little lift, a little amazing luscious life. All hair dryers were definitely not created equal and this is something I learned by fighting with my wife. She came home with this Dyson which was a $350 hair dryer. I'm like you spent what on what? I can get you a Studio Beauty down at the grocery store for like 15 bucks. And that conversation went like most of our conversations. She told me to shut up and just try it and I did and I was actually blown away by the difference. Here's the deal. Cheap hair dryers basically just heat up your hair and they're super damaging and drying if it gets too hot. Now, most of them do have cooler settings, which you should use, but a hair dryer that has some type of ionic function is going to be a lot better, more healthy for your hair, and just work a lot better. There are a lot more affordable hair dryers other than this thing. This thing is just stupid expensive. Um, it's amazing, and my hair has never looked better, but like for 350 bucks, like it's a little crazy. But but what I would recommend is go online, go on Amazon and search for like Ionic hair dryer and see what you can find. It's definitely going to make a difference on your hair looking more amazing. The third simple thing any guy can do to have a better looking hairstyle is use half of the product he's currently using. One of the biggest mistakes I see guys making that is absolutely killing their hair game is they're using way too much hair product, thinking if they want more hold, they need to use more product. The truth is, you don't need to use a ton of hair product. You should just be coating the hair shaft a little bit. It doesn't need to be all like super thick and in there, right? Just about that much, not that much, and then make sure that you're properly emulsifying. This isn't on the uh, the list, but emulsification is actually critical for you to actually use the product properly because the emulsification heats up the molecules in the product. It also allows the product to be distributed a lot easier. A lot of guys just come in and they're like, yeah, and they're using a lot and they're trying to get it, and that just doesn't work. Use half as much, emulsify, and apply. The fourth simple thing any guy can do to have a better looking hairstyle is use a pre-styler like the Pete and Pedro sea salt spray. Pre-stylers are designed to give your hair a little more life. If you're somebody who is currently using a hair product and you're just not happy with the volume or the consistency or texture of your hair, you gotta try a pre-styler. To be honest, I was never a believer in the amazingness of sea salt spray. I always was like, yeah, whatever, it's just a gimmick, right? And then I tried one and I was like, yo, this is the greatest stuff ever because I didn't need to use as much product and my hair had just a whole nother level of texture and volume. And if you guys wanna check out the sea salt 
salt or the Pete and Pedro putty, which is the best product in the universe, in my opinion, but not just my opinion, like a lot of people's opinion. This stuff is incredible. There's a link down below to PeteandPedro.com. There's also going to be a discount code. And if you're not sure what product is right for you, we've got a super cool new feature. We've got a really cool styling aid chart where you go on and select the type of hairstyle you have, how much shine you want, and then also how much hold you're looking for. And then it will spit out a recommendation of what Pete and Pedro product is going to be best for you and your hair. It's totally free and a lot of fun, guys. There's a link down below. Go check it out and see what hair product will be right for you. The fifth simple thing any guy can do to have a better hairstyle is don't waste a damn long in between cuts. Something I've started doing, which has worked incredibly well, is when I go in for a haircut, I will schedule right then a cut for two weeks later. So when I leave, I've already got my next appointment set up. I put a notification reminder in my phone. It's so much easier and better that way because what a lot of guys do is they'll leave, they'll be all like super like, yo, check it out, I just got a fresh cut, and then they'll wait until their cut doesn't look so good and then they wait an extra week after that and then they'll make a call and then they can't get in for two days so it's a disaster gentlemen one of the things that you can do to ensure that your hair looks as good as possible is keep it cut on a regular basis and last but certainly not least the sixth easy simple thing that any guy can do to have a better looking hairstyle is use better hair products now this isn't necessarily trying to sell you on Pete and Pedro but what I am saying there is a huge difference in quality of the products you're going to buy at say a grocery store or a drug store versus the product you're going to buy from like a hair company like Pete and Pedro. Um, the reason why the products at the grocery stores are so cheap is because the ingredients are not real great. They use cheap ingredients, they're going to have a lot of alcohol, the product isn't going to be healthy for your hair. And so they can give it to you at an incredible price, but for me, my hair is worth a lot more than a few extra bucks to buy a quality product. This is one of the reasons why these products are more expensive is because the ingredients are better they're healthier for your hair and they work better um, and so I'm not saying you got to try Pete and Pedro I'm just saying if you are looking to try a better product a better quality product you will see a difference in your hairstyle um, I did a video talking all about like cheap hair products trying to find the best I will link to that down in the description um, some are okay some work pretty well but the bottom line is this if it's cheap and it's sold at a drugstore the ingredients are not going to be that great for your hair and the more I get into sort of understanding hair and ingredients the more I realize what a big deal that is and so for me it's worth it to spend a little extra money guys there's a link down below like I said along with a discount code to Pete and Pedro if you want to give us a try we now have sample sizes shampoo conditioner salt we've got a lot of exciting things happening I think our brushes are back in stock anyway guys thank you so much for watching implement these six simple things and your hair will be luscious flowing locks of incredible amazingness